We've been dealing with raids. A lot of bandits in this area. It's been quiet for a few days. What the hell are you doing here? I thought I'd find you in Jackson. Been trying to bring the plant back to life. We had it working before, but one of the turbines went south. We have electricity, Joel. I had. We'll get her running again. No way. You guys have horses. We got a whole lot of them. Hey, Tommy, give me a hand with this. Sorry, I'll be right back. Can I? Yeah, of course. He likes when you cut his ears. You ever ride one? I actually have. What have you ridden a horse? Uh, Winston is a soldier back in the zone. He gave me lessons. You know, if you want, we can take him riding later. That'd be awesome. There. Hey, thanks, Tommy. No sweat. All right, let's continue the tour. Earl? Yeah? Why are you here? Weren't you supposed to head back this morning? Still waiting on Hauser and the rest of the boys to relieve me. Oh, no. you know, we'll be fine. Just go home to your family. It's just a couple more hours. I'll tough it out. All right. Look, take it easy. Maria. Yeah, go ahead. We're in the control room. Steve's about to start it back up. You want to come check it out? I'd rather eat with Ellie. It's my turn anyway. I'll go. I'll come with you. Go with Maria. Get some food in. Joel. Come on, Ellie. Let's give the boys some space. I'm sending Tommy over. Stand by. Come on. This will be the sixth time of them trying to get the turbines back online. We've been here just a week, and it feels like forever. Uh, I got something for you. Last year I went back to Texas, back home. Most of our stuff is long gone, most of it. Here. It's a little faded, but it still looks pretty good. I'm good. You sure? I mean... I said I'm good. Okay. I'll hold on to it for you. Tommy, I... I need to talk to you. Privately. Yeah. Okay. Let me just check on my guys real quick. Come on. I don't know what you heard, but you should see the town. We're over 20 families strong now. It was Maria and her father, and they set up this place with the idea of being self-sustained. We got crops and livestock. Remember how we thought no one could live like this anymore? And we're doing it. What do you do for protection? The adults take turns guarding the perimeter. We even got an electrified fence when we plant for them. Hey, you still gotta deal with infected though, right? Who doesn't? But it's the world we live in. Or maybe you don't have to be. <laughs> you sound like Marlene. Hey, buddy. That's Buckley. <laughs> Not much of a guard dog. Oh, that's a good boy. Maybe good to have her around. These two geniuses are gonna bring this plant back to life. We think we got it this time. <laughs> you don't believe us? I didn't say that. 
I'll bet you a million bucks it works. Sure. Make it two. Uh, we're almost ready. They just need to finish putting the shield back on. No rush. Let's see what we got. So hold. To the left. Watch it. Okay, that's good. Lower it. Slowly. That's good. Tommy's here. You're good to go. Give me one second. Okay, good to go. Ready? Go ahead. Hit it. Here we go. <laughs> God damn. We did it, boys. Nice work, boys. Somebody get on the horn and give Maria the good news. You see that? Pretty impressive. Looks like you're out two million bucks. <laughs> All right, Joe. Let's go talk. <laughs>